Yo guys, what's up? It's me, Noki Gaming, and I'm coming at you with another video. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. This is the newest game by Scott Cawthon. It came out yesterday, and I just got the chance to play it now. Oh, I've been waiting for a Scott Cawthon game for a long time. Finally, let's, okay, let's play. They don't have pineapple on this? God dang it. I'll put peppers on it. I'm a picky eater. Oh, oh, let's go. Shift. Oh. Round three. Oh, oh. Oh, so you try to follow me? Little son of a biscuit. Try to juke you. Oh, oh. Damn it. Oh, do you have to, like, hit him with pizza in order to. S yeah, that's how it works. Okay. Eat pizza, kid. Alright, come on. Let's go. There. There, alright. Damn it, that didn't work. Alright, come on. Up here. Clear shot. Oh, that didn't work. Round. What the. What the. What the? Did my game crash? Please say it didn't. Hi! Begin tape. Leaving dead space. Three, two, one. The purpose of this tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. Okay, if okay. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift, as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations under paragraph four. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, that's not a scary noise. Document results. Oh, this is so... It's the tape. Audio oh my god. Why is it like a scarier noise every time? Like... Ah! Begin audio prompt in three... Two... One... I was expecting a serious jump scare there. It's a new day. What the? It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. <gasps> it's hand you unit! Money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. <laughs> in some what cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right. Restaurant ownership and management. I'll buy that Something place for sure. anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Okay. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee, such as atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting <laughs> atmosphere is so essential weird. to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. Oh, Having a lot that's of good. entertainment I like that. value in your restaurant like will ensure that customers come back. If you're wondering why my hair is wet, I just Bonus had a shower. Revenue. I was running out here to like games and attractions record can this video. Additional revenue Saving during the money day. is for me. More money in your pocket. Ready yeah, that, that's how I like it. I like those glasses. Health I like my glasses. So that's it. You might die. <laughs> why? Why is that like that? Hey, Frank. Let's chill in Maguchi boy. Maguchi bear. Wear that smile with pride. And let's make some money. Yeah. Your entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. Why do you always include that at the end of everything related to Fazbear? Huh. How to a step 
a two-step guide to restaurant management. Use catalog mode to purchase items, animatronics, and other supplies. Use blueprint mode to place your items, upgrade items, and upgrade your floor plan. Okay, I'm ready. I think I'm ready. Let's go. Let's get started. Yes! How much cash you had left over that is the most adorable thing package. ever. Never gonna give you a fan. I will when you're ready buy to that fan. Your restaurant for business for the day. Click the button labeled "Finished" in Blueprint mode. Give it a try and do some shopping. Yeah, I'll buy the stage. Yep, I'll buy you. And I'll buy this. Hey, cool. I don't have any money though. So this is just sponsorship offer. Okay, sure. Catalog, let's go. Sam's budget tech. I have 250 bucks now. Enhanced speaker set. <laughs> Fruity maze. Oh, it's like Pac-Man, cool. Neon stage lights. <gasps> it's an animatronic! Mr. Hippo, Ned Bear. Cool! Of course, I'm gonna have to go buy some fruity maze. Alright, I think I'm I think I've spent enough for the day. Finished. Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome. Yes! That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. You have a lot of work to do while patrons <gasps> eat their pizza in the other room. <laughs> From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, on to other matters. Oh my god, Something it's a to be aware game! Of. Okay, what am I supposed to do? yourself I hear something I hear something I hear something I hear something don't see anything oh I don't understand this at all I don't get this the place bulbs yes the return of the mystical, myth, mystical thing. It's gorgeous. Log off. Great job. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that day as your ultimate test. Yes. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. Yeah. Yeah, guys, I'm a good entrepreneur. Congratulations on completing your first day. Oh, no. However, your job isn't over just yet. Oh, There's no another way. aspect to your end-of-day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Nope. Things are found here quite often, and while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts which can mean a much needed rep of a new boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside, but then you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences. Why? death, should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared. If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, 
Check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. Or, if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Throw it back into the alley. I don't care. Don't forget Saturday. You want them all to be in one place. Okay, yeah. Hey! New lawsuit zero. <laughs> That's great. I love this. I love this. All right, but that is gonna have to do it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, then please smash that like button. If you have any suggestions or comments, please put them in the comments below. And if you really like my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. I don't know why I'm doing this. Thank you so much, and I'll see you the next time. Bye. Right here.